Dr. Burgos is the director of internal medicine at University Medical Center. He sees coronavirus patients daily and his hospital witnessed its first death this week. Just like last week, I asked him the same seven questions about coronavirus. Here's what he had to say. How has this past week gone for you? We unfortunately had more fatalities, uh, which is something that we unfortunately expected and we knew it was going to happen, uh, but it you know, makes everything a little bit more difficult. Can hospitals handle the current number of patients? We can treat uh, a much bigger number. I mean, we are ready, we have the capacity. What should people at home be doing right now? Keep yourself you know, hopeful, enjoy your family. These are difficult times, so you need to make the best out of it. What's the most eye-opening thing you've seen this week? was probably the patients who passed. I mean, it was an impact for all of us. It was an impact for their families, of course. Um, again, we know that this is something that can always happen, not only for, for coronavirus, but for any case that we handle, we always know that there is a risk. But obviously, based on how difficult the situation is socially, it, it had a huge impact on, on, on us. And, and, you know, we're just trying to overcome that and get ready because it will happen again. It is something that will continue to happen, unfortunately. What's your prediction for next week? We can expect that some of those patients will be going home, will be getting better, but we know that some of those patients might not do that well. Um, so next week is probably going to be a little bit tougher than this one. What's giving you hope at this time? We have elderly patients who are also improving, and, and you know, that is, that is something that makes you think that we can still beat this. What's your message to the borderland? We need to believe science. Even though we don't have all the answers at once, we are gonna keep fighting for the next few months and years until we get answers. And we can make sure that situations like this can be prevented better and can be handled better. Remember, you can always go back and compare how his answers have changed. Just go to our website, kvia.com, and search check-in. Mauricio Casillas, ABC7.